My ass is what I posted on Twitter. Two to the one, the one to the three. I like good pussy and I like good tree. Smoke so much weed you wouldn't believe. And I get more ass than a toilet seat. If you don't know, on New Year's, on Twitter, P.K. Russell posted a picture of, well, his ass. And this was not well met by really anybody. He even flexes the fact that he's done this in his Twitter bio. And, well, in May sometime, he made a video responding to the people talking about him posting his ass. So let's take a look at that. My ass is what I posted on Twitter and I do it again. This is the PK Russell channel. This is not Sesame Street. I got my start on YouTube by reviewing Cuphead P-O-R-N. And I've been doing that the entire time I've had a successful YouTube channel. My content is clearly and unquestionably intended for adults. And it's also a complete flat out lie that my audience is made up of mostly children. One look at my analytics, you'll see the number one biggest category is 18 to 24 years old. Second largest category, 25 to 34 years old. Third largest category, 35 to 44 years old. Fourth largest category is 13 to 17 years old. People will look at these analytics and say, well, they could be lying about their age. Prove it. Okay, here's my analytics, influenced by an entirely different target audience, of which is supposed to be like 13 year olds. As you can see, the majority of it is 18 year olds, which is clearly not true as you know, Duh. And what this would mean is that children do in fact lie about their age. It's been proven time and time again on YouTube. That's why COPPA was instated on YouTube. That's why you have to verify that your video is for people that are 13 or older. It's been said again and again and again. So it's pretty much fact that just because analytics say so doesn't mean it's actually true. Now, even if there were children watching my content, so what? My content is very clearly intended for adults. If children are watching my content, it's not my responsibility. It's their parents. Now, instead of taking the fall because this is a response to the people telling him that he shouldn't have posted his ass on the internet, he blames the parents of the children because the parents aren't monitoring what the kids are watching. And the thing is, while this may be true, it's also your responsibility whether you like it or not. You've clearly shown that you know full well of this fact considering that you brought it up in this response. So you should take it upon yourself to refrain from posting things such as your ass on the internet. As you know, no matter what you do, children will see that post. So the fact that you blame it on the parents just shows how ignorant and stupid you truly are. So, if you don't already know, P.K. Russell loves milking a topic into as many videos as possible, even if he only covers the surface level stuff or just knows nothing about it. He loves to milk it. For example, he's only made, well, no, not only, he's made 22 videos on the surface level gotcha stuff, and I believe he's the start of the, oh, gotcha is terrible because of surface level stuff, hate trend. Uh, you know, that and he's really just not covering anything else and every time he tries something else he just ends up going back to what he was doing before so yeah he loves milking content pk russell has been in a lot of dramas in the past one specific one that some people can probably remember is the one where he made a very, very bad review of Has Been Hotel, where he basically said he watched it three times and yet still managed to seem like he knew nothing about it. And that's, and he got a lot of backlash for that. And when I say a lot, I mean a lot. 
So much, in fact, that he made a response. And then a YouTuber made a video on that response saying, yeah, no, this response isn't that great. And, well, P.K. Russell's response tactics just all devolved down to the same thing, and it's never really worked any of the times that he's used it. And, uh, yeah, that's all about his past dramas. P.K. Russell is a bad person who's very ignorant on how YouTube works and everything, and overall just really, really loves to milk topics and doesn't really listen to hate or criticism whenever he gets it because he thinks he's always in the right. And um, yeah, I don't expect him to listen to this video either, quite frankly. But uh, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, leave a like and a comment, share it with your friends, uh, because all of those things boosted into the algorithm, and uh, subscribe. My heart is so cold, yeah. Like in the Arctic, you gon' need to dumb it down. I ain't a smart kid, you ain't never been my dog. So why you barking? Don't know why you run your mouth. You wouldn't start shit, you've been going through a lot. You took some hard hits, always get back up though. We don't regard it. Pussy's always hating out because we heartless. Pussy's always hating out because we heartless. You think that you're alone just because you're in the darkness. I was stuck up in my thoughts, trapped inside a dark place. Yeah, I know it hurts a lot when you become the target. Drugs will get you high, got you soaring on a starship. Just put all that shit down, I still don't get why you got it. I say it's a cycle, but you still gotta restart it. Go to Vasey, I'ma prove it without Fargib. Calling me a rapper, I'm an artist. Mad cause I ain't spitting, I'm just trying to make some chart hits. I ain't wanna leave, but I didn't, we departed. I've been gone so long.